that that is the safest way to police. You'll follow up on open carry? Um, we know that there was at least one gentleman who was a suspect, person of interest, that during the demonstration he had an AR-15 around his uh, around his shoulder. What does this tell you about people using the new Texas law uh, of, of open carry at a demonstration? That is difficult at best. When we, we express this, you know, it's a little different here in Texas. Where, where, are, you, where are you from? Uh, here. You're from Texas, oh, you know. All right, so it's a little different here in, in Texas in the way we view uh, open carry, concealed carry. Uh, and we, we've had great dialogue with our state legislators about this, and we've expressed all of our concerns. And we're trying as best we can as a law enforcement community to make it work so the citizen can express their Second Amendment rights. Uh, but it's increasingly in, uh, challenging uh, when people have AR-15 slung over and shootings occur in a crowd and they begin running and we don't know or we don't know if they're the shooter or not or they begin has been has been the presumption that a good guy with a gun is the best way to resolve some of these things. Well, we don't know who the good guy is versus who the bad guy is if everybody starts shooting. And we express that concern as well. And, I, I, I have every belief and trust that our folks are listening at the state on, on this issue, particularly as it involves protests. Thank you. Jason?